Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel Learn Math with Mr. Saad for another video lesson. Today's lesson for grade 5, chapter 9, lesson 5. Add unlike fractions. Page number is 637. Guys, in this lesson, we are going to add unlike fractions. Unlike fractions are when the denominators are not same. Like fractions are when the denominators are same. Okay, to find the, the answer of addition, to find the sum for unlike fractions, first of all, we have to make the denominator same. We can't add them until we make the denominator same. To make the denominator same, guys, first of all, we have to find the LCM, least common multiple. We are finding it for the denominator, so you can also call it LCD, least common denominator. Okay. How we find the least common multiple LCM? Uh, we took a whole lesson about the LCM, and I uploaded the video also. You can watch that video, guys, if you forget LCM. Okay. And uh, I will give you a quick review here. See, guys, how we are finding the LCM? We have to find the LCM of the denominators. 3 and 4. So we will write the multiples of 3. 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18, like that. Okay. And then we will write the multiples of 4. 4, 8, 12, 16, 20, like that. And then we choose the least one which is common in both of them. So we can see that 12 is common in both of them. And it is the least one which is common. So that's why least common multiple is 12. The least one which is common in both of them. Okay, this is how we find the LCM. You will keep on writing the multiples until you find a common one. Got it, guys? Okay. Now what you have to do, you have to change your denominators according to the LCM. You have to change your denominators into 12. Okay. This is 3. How you can change it into 12? 3 times what will give you 12? 3 times 4. So you multiply this whole fraction with 4. Remember it guys, we don't only uh, multiply with the denominator. Whatever we multiply down with the denominator, we must multiply the same number up in the numerator. Okay? So we will multiply the whole fraction 1 over 3 with 4. Why with 4? Because 3 times 4 will make it 12 and we need the denominator 12. Similarly with 1 over 4, now 4. 4 times what will give me 12? 4 times 3. So we multiply the whole fraction with 3. So 1 times 3 is 3 and 4 times 3 is 12. Now the denominators are same. 4 over 12 plus 3 over 12 equals 7 over 12. And this is already simplified. We can simplify it. Next one, guys, here. See this? 1 over 10 and 4 over 5. The LCM of 10 and 5, the denominators, the LCM of the denominators is 10. Okay. If you see, the first fraction is already having the denominator of 10. We don't need to do anything with the first fraction. We just write it as it is. 4 over 5. 5 times what will give me 10 because the LCM is 10. So we multiply 4 over 5 by 2 because 5 times 2 is 10. So we multiply 2 down and 2 up. 4 times 2, 8 and 5 times 2, 10. 1 over 10 plus 8 over 10 equals 9 over 10. Similarly here, boys, the LCM of 5 and 2 is 10. Here we find the LCM, you can see. Then we multiply the first fraction by 2. I just write it times 2 up. We are multiplying the whole fraction. So 2 times 2, 4, and 5 times 2, 10. And we multiply this whole fraction by 5. Why? Because we want to change the denominator into 10. And 2 times what will give me 10? 2 times 5. So we multiply this whole fraction by 5. 1 times 5 is 5. 2 times 5 is 10. Now the denominators are same. 10, 10. 
we can add the numerators 4 plus 5 9 over 10 we cannot add the fractions until the denominators are same okay here 3 over 4 plus 1 over 8 the LCM of 4 and 8 it's 8 this fraction already 8 1 over 8 this one we multiply by 2 4 times 2 is 8 so we multiply 2 up and 2 down 6 over 8 plus 1 over 8 equals 7 over 8 similarly guys here in independent practice you guys will make the denominator same by finding the LCM and change your denominators according to the LCM you see here we did it the denominator the LCM of the denominator 3 and 6 is 6 so we change them into 6 and then you add them so solve all these questions in independent practice and then match your answers through this video okay a farmer harvested some of his pecan crop on friday and saturday what fraction of the pecan crop was harvested in the two days have to add them make the denominator same the lcm of 8 and 3 is 24 and then add them angel has two goals after school she racks leaves for three fourth hours and spend half hour washing the car how long does Angel spend on her toes and all? So you have to add them all, make the denominator same and add them. You will get an improper fraction, the numerator bigger than the denominator. You will convert it into a mixed number. If you forgot that, how to convert an improper fraction into mixed number, you can watch the video for that lesson. It's available on my channel. Okay. And this one, Leon Rat bags of leaves from his neighbor's yard monday he racked one third of bag of leaves tuesday three eight and wednesday one four so we add all of them the lcm of the denominators three eight and four is 24. you change the denominators into 24 and then it will be 23 over 24. so it is not more than one bag it's less than one 23 over 24 so no not more than one bag circle the expression that does not belong with other three if you add them you'll get 7 over 6 7 over 6 7 over 6 but here you will get 8 over 6 they want you to write another fraction uh, this one they want you to change it into a mixed number so how many six we can take out of seven one and remainder one over six another fraction which will give you seven over six another one you can give me another fraction in the comment box and here some explanation about the equivalent fractions we are using to make the denominator same I hope you guys understand the lesson. If you really understand, don't forget to like this video and subscribe my channel, Learn Math with Mr. Saad. And also press the bell icon to get notified for every new video. Thank you so much, guys. Have a nice day.